Um, so we do have, so we posted about Heartstopper on our Twitter and people went insane. They were so excited. We got just the best response. And so what we did is um, we took some, some questions from our Twitter followers and they have some questions for you. Uh, hello, my name is William Gao. I play Tao Su in Heartstopper, and you are watching Young Entertainment Mag. Okay, sweet. Ready to jump in? Yeah, let's do it. Awesome. So sure. they want to know. Um, so we have Ellie. Her handle is Will X Mercer. Um, in your opinion, what do you think Tao's favorite film would be? Oh, that is a very, very difficult question. I think his, oh, I think his favorite film would be, I mean, in the show, his favorite, he really loves Donnie Darko. Um, but I think personally, he would love a Quentin Tarantino film. So let's go basic. Let's say Pulp Fiction. Love that. Very cool. Uh, I love the thought process on that. Um, so we have, I'll have the handle. We'll pop it up right here. I'm not exactly sure how to pronounce this handle, but they want to know, do you have a funny story from set that you want to share with us? Funny story from set that I want to share with you. Yeah, there was one moment uh, we were we were done for the day and Kit and I, uh, the wonderful Kit Connor, uh, we we get the same car. We got the same like we went home together at the end of every day. Like we had the same 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 car. And um, before we left, I was doing my makeup, doing the D-rig, which is where you take your hair and make it not Tal's hair and then take the make makeup off and everything. And out the window, there was like, we, we the, the trailers were like right outside a football stadium. And there was like this music blasting out of the music stadium. And I just saw like Kit, like doing, just dancing, like <laughs> surviving so well. And I found it really funny. I do have a video of it, um, which will probably never be released. But oh, it was man. The, thing of, um, the thing of him just dancing and we were vibing. And then I walked out the trailer and I was just like, we were just dancing and we basically danced the whole way back home. So, yeah. Oh, I that love that. Oh my gosh. Well, maybe just maybe you should share that video sometime because that sounds awesome. Maybe, maybe one day with, with Kit's uh, permission because yes. the dancers were pretty, they were pretty funky. They were pretty, <laughs> pretty cool. That's awesome. Okay, and we have another question. I thought this was a fun one. It's from at Spring Silver. What would Tao wear to the Met Gala? Tao Su. Mm -hmm. What would Tao Su wear to the Met Gala? I think Tao Su would go for um, like a very strong suit, but in a really funky color. Ooh, yes. I think you'd go for that. Yes, you think with a beanie too? Do you think he'd yeah. wear a beanie? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he'll either do that or he'll just rock up in a beanie, like joggers and like a hoodie. Yes. No in between. Like he's either going to go for crazy colors on a beanie. There's a beanie, like there's no question there's going to be a beanie at the Met Gala. But it's like what color is the beanie and like what accessories are on the beanie? I love that. Yeah. I feel that. I can see that vibe. Um, we got this one a lot. So because Tao says something about Avengers movies in the show, um, this, this person specifically asked, does William like Avenger movies or any other Marvel movies since Tao himself hates Avenger movies? I actually, yeah, I, I love a good Marvel movie. I think it, it could be really fun. Um, yeah, who love... doesn't, right? Yeah, I love, love Spider-Man and I um, love all that stuff. And I think they've got some great, great films and stuff. And yeah, I have a lot of time for it. I mean, Tao is very much a film, like a film student. He really loves his films. So 
I can see why he would be like very true to the art of the film and everything. And whereas Marvel's more like action, like crazy stuff going on. But I have a lot of time for Marvel. I think, I think they're really cool. Yeah, amazing. So yeah. your la our last question um, from Twitter, Lover Nile says, "What was your favorite line or some of your favorite lines from the show?" Um, that you either just enjoyed performing the most or that meant something to you? Um, I think there's a lot of lines that I really enjoyed. Um, it's really difficult. You're really jogging my memory because we feel we, we shot the, the show quite a long time ago. Um, there was one that we actually talked about uh, during the press junket where, where, where it was like, Rude. I say rude in a Scottish accent. I think that was quite fun because the other cast members weren't expecting it. And when I said it, like it was a bit of a shock for them all. Um, and that was really, that was quite a fun line to do. And then if I was picking another one, I'd say probably the one about the DMs was quite fun. It was like, um, I was going to say I'd, I'd send them a passive aggressive DM, but murder's fine too. I think that's quite a, a very Taoesque line. Um, and That's I think hilarious. that was really fun. And that, yeah, that, that, that was made into a, Netflix made that into a meme or something apparently, um, which is really fun. Um, but yeah, really good line. That's those two, those two, yeah. Amazing. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. It has been such a pleasure getting to talk with you. We're such a huge fan of your work. So we're so grateful um, to have the opportunity to share this interview with our, our fan base. They're going to be so excited to tune in. Thank you again, and it was wonderful talking with you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Yes, have a great evening. Bye.